So using direct wave and fruity loops, you can make the best soundboard for playing music in a game. By assigning every individual track or clip of a track to an individual key and setting that key to be the uh, root note for that zone. Also setting the loop mode to one shot, which means it will play through the entire clip without having to hold the key and setting the note velocity to not affect the gain, which will mean that it will play at full volume every time. You have it set up so any key on your keyboard, not your desktop keyboard, your MIDI keyboard, can control or play a song. <clears throat> and then using a MIDI controller, you can assign a slider to a volume, so that you can dynamically control the volume while the shit's playing. You can just completely turn it off if the slider decides it wants to work and not be retarded. Alright, I guess I'm going to have to find a new slider because it's acting weird. Um, <laughs> but yeah, very, uh, very efficient way to play music in-game without having to alt-tab ever and have as many tracks as you have keys on a MIDI keyboard able to be played at any time. You can do some other funky shit, like you can affect, uh, you, you can use the mod matrix to make any of the any of the available controls in here affect any of these things, which you probably shouldn't, but if you want to fuck with people, you could, per se, make it so the LFO of the program, this thing, which is a low frequency oscillator, which means it's going from 1 to 0 constantly, and it has a waveform or shape, you can make it so that will affect the pitch of the sound, so that it will play faster and slower and faster and slower, <laughs> or something retarded like that. Point being, it's a very useful way to control audio in-game without ever having to alt-tab or worry about essentially anything. <laughs>